Hello YouTube and the internet, this is Joe on day number 20. Alright, we got ourselves some bruised Bosque pears. A bruised Barlet pear. A bruised, very bruised, sunrise apple from Canada. Some celery sticks that were bruised. And we have some shiitake mushrooms. Here, this one, you can see has some sort of uh, blackening on it and that needs to be cut off and that is not necessarily someone's going to pay a high price for that one and same with that one definitely just dried out and red on the veins I feel like that's not a quality thing and it makes good compost if you just eat part of it or all of it I really don't go for ones like this usually um, it's kind of bruised on the top as well all right, it's a really subjective spectrum here um, when it comes to produce. All right, and some blackberries, some more bruised on top and squished, and mold comes right on in. And we have co-op made granola parfait with mixed berries, very delicious. All right. Also, the bag, Iowa Prairie Network. Bum, 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 bum. Dun, 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 dun. Look at this. It is very cool. All right. So, the Iowa Prairie Network. It's a network of people that want to have prairie in Iowa. Tall grass prairie. You want to have tall grass prairie because it will sequester carbon from the atmosphere, mitigating climate change. You can have rotational grazing of animals, also known as stock cropping, livestock. Yeah, livestock cropping or having your livestock eat your crop residue and that can be bison or buffalo cow or pig chicken or sheep the Iowa Prairie Network has a lot to offer uh, shout out to them with their organizing we need to have more awareness for prairie restoration here in the future 2020 was a hard enough year but It'll be even harder in 50 years if we continue business as usual, farming our soils. We won't have them, so we need to act proactively instead of 50 years from now just having ecological collapse and topsoil loss and nutrient runoff and more dead zones and less biodiversity. We have to stop cutting down the rainforest and clearing the wild ways. We need to have cohabitation zones. So at least 10% of a crop field should be prairie minimum, like on the marginal areas next to waterways and hills or slopes where the tractor can't get to as easily or it's more vulnerable then yeah have prairie tall grass prairie there's even government subsidies the 2018 farm bill had an update to the conservation reserve program called conservation practice 43 which allows farmers to use an existing combination of conservation practices to set aside 10 to 25 percent of their land into crp for 10 to 15 years, they can get payments, and the first year, they get a 32.5% sign-on bonus. And if you know people like me, you can get your seeds for free, because there are a lot of different places that have seeds, and it's getting connected. And of course, you're going to have to purchase them at larger quantities, but I'm pretty sure you can find some people that are really generous in the community that want to give space to the non-human other, which is really important, prairie restoration, of course. All right, on that note, it worked today. The deli was able to save all of the juicing scraps compost, and that was distributed locally to someone. And that is a good business model, is when you take the waste of capitalism or the waste of business and you make it more of a closed loop system instead of uh, going to the landfill and releasing methane which is 28 times more potent than carbon dioxide as a greenhouse gas so just little things and working with your community to do curbside compost pickup or local composting or food waste diversion programs would be great because the Ugly Food Movement is a great example of that, and also the Bill Emerson Good Samaritan Food Donation Act of 1996. Check that out. 
That's why I'm able to make this video. All right, prairie and compost. You can take the compost of any grocery store and you could make improvements in soils anywhere for anything. So look into that. Peace.